Good morning. It is January 3rd already. And I did good yesterday. I stayed quiet. I was productive. Um, and I felt good in my body and my spirit and my mind until last night. Um, we're, I'm watching the morning show. And I don't know if anybody has watched that, but... Um, it's really interesting, good. I love the actresses. Um, but honestly, it creates a little bit of trauma in me. And um, uh, they were, you know, if any of you have followed me for very long, you know that I've had an abortion. Um, I am, I understand the whole mentality of all of it. Um, and I still think it's wrong, but I'm never going to judge somebody for doing that, um, because what I think is wrong, that's my, um, and I don't really think you can push your, um, own morals on somebody else. Um, I'm not going to push my morals on someone else. Um, I believe it's wrong because I don't think that, um, honestly, I don't think the government or anyone really thinks about the woman. Um, because having an abortion is extremely traumatic, and I had one that um, was after the first trimester. And it's hard for me to talk about. Um, but there was a part in this show that uh, just triggered. And um, all the memories of that abortion came running back to my head. I mean, that was nearly... 38 years, 35 years ago, 36 years ago, hold on, I can't really remember, a long time ago, um, and I could hear the sound, I could smell what I smelt, um, our memory is an interesting thing, um, So, yeah. So, I've decided with that that I'm going to be very careful what I watch in the evenings because it messed with my head last night and sent me into a panic attack. Um, now, my husband didn't help, and um, we're working on that. Uh, he said some things, and I had to say stop, and he didn't stop. Uh, you know, you can set up boundaries, but if people don't listen, it makes it really difficult. Um, so yeah, I just wonder how people did life before there was so much understanding about mental, your, your mentality. I think I'm, I'm off social media to a degree and honestly, I think there's so much bombardment, bombardment of um, the noise of all the conditions and all the things triggering and the, you know, I think it gets you hyper-focused on your mental condition instead of actually just living um, so watch out with that with social media make sure you you know I follow and have started unfollowing a lot of um, accounts that just talk about your mental health um, anything you hyper focus on is not going to be good on your in your for your thoughts and plus it kind of um, sumps you from 
doing things. And so, get off social media. And live. Uh, I'm, I'm listening to a book called Outlive. And, and then I'm, I've also been listening to, you know, longevity and, you know, understanding what's going on in my body and we got to take care of our mind, body, and spirit and that means staying off of these damn things. <laughs>